Hey, welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to look at a song, one of my favorites. I'm doing a gig and they wanted more Yacht Rock songs. So we thought we would do I Love You by the Climax Blues Band. I listen to it. It's mainly a keyboard driven song. I've done the guitar solo before on this channel, so you can look that up. But this is uh, third fret capo. I keep my capo, I tend to like it closer to the fret before it. Because a lot of times if I'm doing congested chords here, I don't want that thing hitting my hand. There's really no tricky chords here. There's a couple of licks and stuff, and I'll show that. And there's a lot of cross-walking chords that I, you know, like a G over B to C. And now the song is in F, but we're going to call it D. Because we're going to call the chords off as if the capo weren't here. Let's get started. So the opening lick goes... And then we cut right in. So that's basically like an A to a G to an A to a G to a quick D. And then we start. But let me just show you. So the lick is like, I play it just like hammering. And then. Now he starts to sing. We play an A. When I was an A again, a younger man to a G. I had him to care. Now here he's gonna pump the C over G. So it's when I was A, a younger man to a G. Fooling around another G. D. Wait for it. So that's a C A came to me. Now the second time, instead of hitting the A twice, it's A to an F sharp minor. So it's you. To a D major and to an A. And that's like a D over A that he just pumps there. And there's a lot of that in the song. So let me grab my pick real quick here. And so again, it's... When I was a young man, I had to care. Around, the ground, the Now we get to the, what do you call it, chorus here? Since then, this is a D over F sharp to an F6. Now sometimes you can hear the board, the keyboard rolls it to a... He comes off the 6 to a whole um, F. Well, it's A flat, but here we're playing... The guitar, it's our F shape, so it's like G. Since then, to a C over E, to a G over B, to a C, G over B, A. And that brings us to verse 2. Now, verse 2 is going to be identical. Chorus 2. Now the chorus 2 is a double chorus. Now 
now we're going to go into the solo. But before we do, I just want to show you the way I'm playing this F6. So when I get to this, this D over F sharp, I'm basically coming out of a G. And so I'm using my middle finger on the F sharp, my ring finger here on the A, and my pinky there to make the full D chord. Well, there's no third except for here. And then when I come down, I'm playing it like fourth string, third string, second string with the bass. To a regular F. To a C over E. Now we're going to play the guitar solo. Not the solo, but the accompaniment. So in the solo, D, B minor, C, F, C, and that's just a B, A, G, 2, 3, and that's F sharp B. This time it's just a little different. To a double chorus. All right, so real quickly, one more time with the solo section. Okay, then it's the double chorus. Then it's the solo section, and then it's the chorus again, doubled, except at the end of this chorus when it goes. And it holds it. And that's basically the whole song. It's a fun one to play. It's a lot of fun uh, little things that are going on that I've added there for you. Because when I hear, those are the things that make it important to me when I'm playing it. Like when I hear those like, um, just all those, you know, those type of, all that type of stuff. All the walking stuff on the roads that he's doing, which I love. Anyways, I hope you like it. I hope this helps you play the song and you have a lifetime of fun playing it. As always, everybody. Very good.